video i'm gonna share with you guys a pack with me for summer camp basically i go away tomorrow it's a five day camp i'm gonna show you guys what i'm taking first up is the bag this is from kmart it's this big black bag it's got a little keychain to like ever so slightly stand out but um it's very basic um it does technically have wheels but they like literally don't work but it's fine um it will do so i'm just gonna be loading everything into here so I like to organize my first day outfit. I think this is super handy because when you're packing, obviously you also want to plan your first day's outfit, but you don't want to actually put it in your bag. So for the first day, I'm going to be wearing these shorts from Princess Polly. They're super cute. Like this, it's got these really cute little butterflies, which are very me, but at the same time, it's just charcoal and very simple and plain. So no one can make like too much of a first opinion on you on the first day. I'm going to wear these little sleepers the whole time. And then I just have this little pearl bracelet and this gold necklace from Alana Maria. So that's what I'm also gonna wear on day one. I'm gonna take my white platform Crocs um, for day one as well. For putting stuff into the bag, I wanna start with like the bulkier items and stuff I don't actually think I'm even gonna use. So we have, of course, a raincoat, cause like, I don't think I'm gonna use this. I don't even know where this is from. It's from Campus Spirit. I actually got this from my friend. It's like a hand-me-down of hers. So we have that. Um, a jersey fitted sheet. Um, be careful when you're going on a camp. They might not actually have fitted sheets, you guys. So you need to remember to take all of that stuff, which is super annoying. I'm just taking this little pink starry towel because it's small and great. So let's load that in first. There is a pool where I'm going, so it's possible I might go swimming. In this bikini from Baku, it's got this really cute little top and then these little bottoms. I love it. I think it's so nice. It's like one of my favorite bikinis. Because it's a camp, you also have to wear board shorts, so I'm taking these ones. I got them from Kmart. I love these because they don't like chafe your skin. They're not like that like board short material. And then just this little short sleeve billabong rashy as well. So day two, I'm gonna wear these white shorts. They are the comfiest things. Um, they just have a really nice fit. They're from Alex and Nia. I love Alex and Nia shorts because they have like sevens and nines in their sizes instead of just having like a six and eights and then ten. I personally find I'm always like in between sizes with shorts. And then I'm gonna wear this little green top. It's just a really nice little basic top. It's gonna be super comfy. Um, and also day two is supposed to be really hot. I don't wanna be sweaty or anything. This is another little singlet top I'm also just taking. It's by Luck and Trouble. Um, I'm gonna throw that in there too. It's super flowy and light. I might decide to wear this one as well. But if not, it's just a little extra. Then day three, I'm gonna wear these green shorts from Cotton On. They're super nice and flowy. This top from Gander, which goes with it so nice. It's so comfy. It's this big um, top from Gander. And honestly, kind of looks like pajamas, this outfit, but it's like so comfortable, like who cares? Okay, day four, I'm actually gonna wear a skirt, which is kind of weird. I wouldn't definitely recommend this for camp. It definitely depends what you're doing on the camp. I'm someone who loves wearing a skirt. I think it's so girly and cute. Um, and I don't know, I'm good with skirts, but if you're not so comfortable in them, of course, definitely don't bring them on a camp. So it's this little one, it's by Tiger Lily, it's super cute. Um, and this is from Sports Girl. For day five's outfit, I'm gonna wear these little shorts, they're from Supre. Um, they're very short, like on me, they're actually very short because they're like high waisted, so it's not great. And then this top from Gander, it's super cute. Um, yeah, again, just really nice big comfy clothes for camp is really important. Of course, you don't want anything too much with your shoulders showing because you don't want to get sunburnt, eh? Is, yeah, that's kind of all. Okay, then I'm just going to throw in this little top as well. It just says the Hamptons on it. It's super cute. It's just like little white tee that I thrifted. I'm just going to take it as well just so that I have another extra in case something goes wrong with all my clothes right now. Of course, you always need to be prepared for weather on camps. It's not always going to be sunny even though this is a summer camp, so I have actually checked the weather. You've got to be careful and check the weather. So I'm going to Goldstone Gorge. It's going to be raining and pretty cold. So I'm also going to take a pair of jeans and a pair of trackies. So I'm taking these jeans, they're so cute. They're like very 90s. I got this pair of denim jeans, which are so nice. I got these just super cute little square ribs and they go out like super low cut. And then I'm also taking these little like fluffy gray track pants just from Cotton On. I'm not really gonna make like outfits out of them. They're more just like in case because I'm just like gonna cross my fingers and hope that it's gonna be sunny, you know? I feel like if I pack sunny clothes, this is so not a good idea, but if I pack sunny clothes, then it will be sunny, which is like the epitome of what's not gonna happen. It'll probably do the opposite, but like whatever, let's just ignore that. 
So that's what we're gonna pack and then it can just go with any tops. Okay, then of course PJs are super important. I'm just packing this top. It's like one of my old school tops. I love to wear it to bed. Um, and yeah, you can watch. To see us all wearing these tops, watch the year 10 school vlog. I'll link it in the description, but we all wear those tops in it. That's so gonna be the video. <laughs> And then I'm gonna wear these little Peter Alexander um, silk shorts with it. I'm just taking this big charcoal hoodie. It's by White Fox, <laughs> but it's um, super comfy. I love it. And then I'm taking this little jumper. It's um, from Supre, but it's just such a nice basic. It's just like a crew neck, so it's like really light and easy to take in my bag. And Hey guys, I just wanted to come and let you know the camp vlogs are almost posted. So subscribe and get ready. They are gonna be here very, very soon. So for shoes, I'm going to take these Nikes, they're super cute, they're like rainbow. I'm literally obsessed with them, I love them so much. I'm going to take these slides as well, just in case. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm literally not going to be able to fit all my stuff in my bag, this is so bad. Okay. Okay, so then I'm taking this little makeup bag, Um, it's just got like a whole bunch of makeup products. I'll really quickly run through them for you guys. For bronze, I'm taking this Clinique little bronzer and this Sports Girl bronze blush. These little Lancome concealer. This mascara by Mecca. A whole bunch of these little Revlon sticks. So I'm taking the blush one, the highlighter one, and the concealer one. And they just like go on like a little like zinc kind of thing situation. This little Revlon brow crayon with a little spoolie on the end. And then this Natio brow gel to hold that all in place. I don't use like foundation or anything, but I am taking like a little um, see-through sun cream thingy just i don't really know anymore um some pawpaw and a little eyelash color that's all i'm taking for makeup then i'm taking toiletries in this little bag my friend got for me back in like year five i love it it's from sports girl i'm taking this victoria secret body spray i'm just gonna plan on like ending the rest of this and just having a really nice smelling cabin i'm taking a bunch of hair bands some nail polish remover pads because we do do our nails a lot i don't know if we're going to there but I am gonna have nail polish on and I might wanna take it off and you know. I'm taking a little bit of jewelry. I'm just taking this little necklace and another set of earrings just in case I wanna mix it up a little bit. A little white scrunchie, some deodorant. These set off the fire alarm because it's an aerosol, but I tell you now, there is no way I'm gonna be using a roll on. And also, I haven't actually been to this campsite, but the other crew campsite sets off the fire alarm. So frustrating. I remember one year I set it off, my cabin, it was horrific. The whole fire alarm goes off at like 10 o'clock at night. The whole cabin has to like evacuate, including like all the other cabins in the building. And it was just so embarrassing for us. But a pink toothbrush, of course. A pink hairbrush. Some toothpaste, of course. We want to have nice smelling breath. Um, some Avamis for my nostrils. Um, some lip balm. Actually, I won't take this lip balm. I'm gonna swap it out because, oh, kidding, I will. Some Ventolin, some Keen Minds, and some Nurofen, and then my Invisalign box. Okay, then I have toiletries I think are gonna spill. So they're in this little bag, it's a Ziploc bag. So in here I have Aeroguard. Aeroguard is always a take on camp because you do not know how bad the bonzies are gonna be, and they're normally pretty bad. Sun cream, of course, you gotta keep that SPF. We gotta have this young looking skin. I'm taking soap. This one actually smells really good. Shampoo and conditioner, just in like travel size Pantene. I personally love using Ziploc bags for like any storage when you're going away. Like, I feel like they're super handy. Definitely would recommend putting a whole bunch of little things if you're worried about them spilling or if you're just worried about like wet clothes. Taking a little like plastic bag is super handy. And because the camp is like a Christian camp, we do have to take. Oh my gosh. I'm taking a Bible, a notepad, and some pens. We also need a sleeping bag. This one's from Kathmandu. I find it so soft, so comfy. I used to have a different one, and I got this one for Duke of Ed, and so nice. So I'm taking this pillow. It's just like white with little dots, you know. I'm not really sure if I'm gonna put these in like this bag or bring like a tote or something as well. I often bring a backpack just to be organized. I don't know yet, I'll see. But I'm also taking a drink bottle, um, a bucket hat, the best some sunnies, and some cash. By cash, I legit mean cash because I've gone on camps where they've been like places to buy things or I once had to like buy morning tea and afternoon tea 
and if you didn't have cash you couldn't so i would definitely recommend bringing some cash i'm just bringing 35 dollars so not much just like a little bit of cash just in case and then of course the lollies so i'm taking these sour straps they're super light super cheap so grab them party mix they didn't have any family size which i honestly think is an outrage so we have the smaller one but it's fine they're the best we have smarties everyone keeps hating on me for my smarty obsession but i love them i think they're delish there's also so many so you can be like really generous and everyone feels like they've had heaps um when you share them you know what i mean but like there's just heaps then i got some lifesavers because again they're just so good and they take a long time to eat and some gum so yeah definitely bring snacks even if it says no food never follow that rule that's what they're saying on this camp ain't no way bring your food i should probably not be like telling you guys to not follow the rules but i am but it's fine okay um wherever you guys are going on camp whether you're just packing along with me and thought this was entertaining i hope you enjoyed um but if you guys are just packing um good luck you're gonna have a really nice organized bag it's gonna be really packed do not worry do not overstress do not procrastinate um have an amazing time wherever you're going and yeah go subscribe i love you guys so much bye it was i